Right now at 11, a choir director from Bucks County facing criminal charges. He's accused of hiding cameras in a bedroom to record a former student as he undressed. This is NBC 10 News. I'm Jacqueline London. And I'm Jim Rosenfield. This involves the choir director at Central Bucks West High School. We sent NBC 10's Matt DeLucia there tonight where he spoke with parents. Yeah, the parents we spoke with say this is just a terrible thing. The longtime choir director here, Joseph Ort, is behind bars tonight. And now the DA's office is asking any other victims to come forward. It's devastating. I mean, you know, I have kids in, in uh, two kids in the school and, you know, it's very troubling. Some parents tonight were just finding out that longtime Central Bucks West Choir Director Joseph Ort was arrested. The Bucks County District Attorney's Office says the 56-year-old set up cameras in a bedroom at his Buckingham home to record video of a former student. The young man had a close mentoring relationship with Ort and moved into his home after graduating in 2016. Investigators say one of the videos showed the victim naked as he changed clothing. Police got tipped off last spring. When a detective went to Ort's home in September, no one answered, but police left a business card. A month later, investigators say another young man living at Ort's home said Ort gave him a laptop to destroy, along with bags of suggestive clothing and four hidden cameras. Instead, he brought everything to police. No one answered at Ort's home tonight. The teacher has been with CB West for several decades. Pop singer Pink went to the school. She tweeted a video tribute from students last summer, saying Mr. Ort was my high school choir teacher. The Central Buck School District says it is cooperating fully with the DA's office. Ort is still employed, but a district spokesperson said his retirement, effective June 10th of this year, was accepted by the Board of School Directors on December 6th. The retirement follows a leave of absence. Tonight, some parents say they'll have a talk with their own kids. We keep an open dialogue, so I'll just confirm that nothing, nothing uh, untoward has happened. And I did reach out to Joseph Ort's attorney, but I have not yet heard back. Bail was set at $50,000. In Doylestown, I'm Matt Delusha, NBC 10 News.